All right, guys. So welcome back to another episode of Man of Medan. This is episode four, I think. I've already lost count. Uh, this game is fucking awesome. Um, something really interesting to take into account. We have to find an opportunity to escape. That is the objective of this scenario here with Fliss. So let's move forward. I have a feeling somebody will die. Tell me where we are going, damn it! I'm not going to tell you that, Fliss. Come on. Come on now. Probably going to use us. Aren't we here already? Or... I don't know. This place looks very familiar. Oh, would you look at that? Hey! Back off! Hey, 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 relax. Leave that alone. Come on. Okay, let me not fuck around before I get shot. <laughs> I wish there was like a little sequence you that you could do. You know what you're doing. You just do whatever he tells you, don't you? Oh, get into his... Get into his head. I can fear like a keep moving like an inferior human being that's the trick here fliss i see you are a smart brave young woman i appreciate that but you're barefoot your feet must be extremely disgusting right now oh he's done come on danny don't fuck around <sighs> all right Nothing interesting here. I don't think I can go backwards anyway, so. Why is he like a room behind me? I don't get it. Are you that scared, Danny? Huh? Are you really that scared? Oh, God. No, no, no. All right, come out. Show yourself. Daddy's tripping. Damn it. <laughs> Daddy's tripping. <laughs> this man is going crazy. This fucking place is cursed. Oh, that? I am with you on that one. Finally, one thing we can agree on. SS. Medan, and she Medan, and it has SS on it. So that's actually very interesting. Hold on, dude. I'm going around. Relax. Hey, yo, relax. Fucking Danny. Not my fault. You're scared shitless. Okay. What was that noise? What are you talking about? I don't want to hear anything from you. Okay, Danny. Sure. Olsen! stays on the ship. Come on. You have no idea what you're talking about. All right. Well, let's investigate. I'm not even scared of this game anymore. Not at all. Look, it's not even that bad. Huh. Where did all your friends go? I don't know what the fuck this is all about, but we got to keep moving and find Olsen. Now. A screaming corpse. What was that? So we got some secrets here. These are all the things that we've encountered. I don't think you find them all in order, so that's that's a good thing. Um, speedboat proposal. These are all the uh, bearings. What is that? Oh, Julia waited to decompress before surf. Okay, so those are like the odd. Man, qu'est-ce que tu fais? 
So like the crucial decisions that you make. Oh no 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 Oh fuck Hey chill we need to look at that I need to look at that picture asshole What a fucking Yo Piece of shit, Danny. Can I look at it here? Pictures. You don't even let me see it, man. What the hell? Maybe, oh, maybe, maybe, maybe he goes missing or something. He dies and then we come back and take a look at it then. I think that's what's going to happen. Yep, that's exactly what's going to happen. C'est quoi ce bordel? What the hell? I want to say he definitely saw some sort of ghost or some shit. Wait, did he die? Of course, give me a creepy ass flashlight. Why don't you? Oh dear. I hear footsteps. Oh no, that's just the music. Okay, see exactly what I knew was gonna happen. What is that? I'm not gonna go that way. I'm gonna go this way. Thank you very much. A hold. It's this way. The question here lies. Ooh, why, why didn't we pick up the gun? Should have picked up the gun. Wait, isn't there a gun back there? Wait, 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 wait. No, no, didn't Danny leave a gun? I could have sworn he left the gun there. His hat? So he only left the hat and the hat. Okay. What an ass. You're a fucking ass, Danny. Oh, you're going to leave a girl like this stranded with no weapon? I, I need to take a shit right now. I, like, I don't know if it's because I'm scared, but... Hello? Is anyone there? Oh, God. Convenient vent. Ah! Oh! I need to take a shit. Dude, I need to go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. All right, we're back. Let's do this. All right, guys. Jesus Christ. Let's go this way. I saw something glowing. Here it is. Another one of these. A lot of these. Our duty on hold a, th a, th a three A. 
Five two. Watch standard sign, Reed Miller, Davis Perez, and Griffin crossed out O'Neill. Why is O'Neill crossed out? Strictly no author unauthorized entry to the guard areas. Do not leave post until you are relieved by oncoming watch standard. Interesting. Oh, dear goodness. I just saw a fucking ghost. Dude, why are people still just leave? I know you're trying to find a way out and get your friends, but fuck that. Oh, Jesus. What happened down here? not letting me read that i was trying to thought there was something to interact with here i know i gotta go through that door but before i want to go to the middle here on this side might be able to find something useful or just get scared shitless one of the two nonetheless it's important to investigate in these types of games because you see it just helps i don't know what i'm saying Be careful. I have to be very careful. That knife. If we go to the premonitions, I think it was one of these. Um, it's not that one. It's one of these right here. Hold on. That one. You see? You can't tell who it is. Somebody got stabbed. So I have to be extra careful. And this is what I wanted to interact with. There we go. Ooh, so who was this? Miller? Perez? Griffin? Perez. Rex Perez. Boston. Sorry, dude. So sorry. Oh, come on. Don't fuck around with me, right? Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Fuck, shit, fuck. All right. All right, let's go. Brad, I would... Buck up. Buck up, you mother. I would stay here, Brad. I would not go anywhere. I I mean you you can't go anywhere actually. Alright, 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 all right, all right, buck up. Buck it up. Buck it up, B boy. Alright, be it up B. You're right there, why don't you just call for help? Let's do this. You know? Radio and help, nobody sees you, so what Uh, <laughs> now we're here with little good old Brad, a little goody goody boy that has no idea what the fuck he just got himself into. Y'all yeah, just need to get some shoes on because everybody's here is barefoot. This is no joke, man. There's sharp objects. There's a bunch of shit here. It's dangerous. Now we have to be careful because of the premonition this guy got stabbed. So we have to be extremely cautious with our choices. Probably... Hello? Who's there? This can't be good. Probably do not pick up any sort of weapon. Just in case. Because he does get stabbed. I'm going to keep that in mind. Mm. 
Oh no. Uh, I don't want to go there. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold the fuck on. Isn't that 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 powder that? Isn't that that powder that made everybody evil? Or not evil? What am I saying? Like made everybody go crazy and shit. That's that same powder. There's something else here. Is that the ring? This is Julia's. Why is it beat up? They're here. Okay. They were here. Oh my god, we do have to go back over there. Nope. Oh, well, I'm glad I came this way because now we found the ring. That's good. Jesus Christ. And this is me actually walking fast because walking slow is almost just as fast as a fast walking, or walking fast is just as slow as slow walking. <laughs> really does make a whole lot of a difference that gas being there is not good that is it's fucking cursed wait is there anything here oh my god dude this is creepy as shit no 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 not going there bro Right, let's see you, sons of bitches. Come on, do something. Oh god, oh god, fuck. Holy shit on a shamrock. What happened here? Oh my god, what the hell? Division. General Infantry 14th Division. D division. 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 Dumbass. Oh, God. Bro, that is crazy. Creepy. Locker room? Sure. Let's go to the freaking locker room. Oh, my God. Brad, Hello? be careful, Brad. You be, you be careful, Brad. Oh, hell. <sighs> Great. Perfect. Wonderful. How does this place even have light in the first place? Dude, there's. Oh. <laughs> Fuck this place. Fuck. Oh, God. You say, yo, okay, you need to relax. This game's getting a little too fucking intense. What am I hearing? We're hearing the sounds of death. Well, no, we got to go back there, man. There's more shit to investigate. Unfortunately, we got to keep getting scared to get the best possible options here. Got to go here. Yes, check out the bathroom. Make sure every, everything is okay. And obviously, it's not going to be okay because now you're about to get scared the fuck out. <laughs> See, it's the obvious little shit like that that gets the sh fucking nuts scared off of me. Disgusting. Oh, that's just beautiful. Give me a fucking break. Brad, I'm gonna give you one more suggestion. Get the fuck out of here. That's Julia. I mean, uh, that's Fliss. Fliss or... Oh, I hate this. Oh, no. Why, why, why the hell does he have a freaking pedicure on? Or does it just look like that? 
guide. I would have been dead. I would have been fucking dead. Oh my god. I could be Olsen or Junior. I think Danny's dead. <laughs> I think Danny died, bro. Okay, that was Buck up, beat boy. Buck up. That was just your imagination, uh, Brad. Everything's gonna be okay. You see? Everything's fine. Nothing's happened here. This is just all uh, hallucinations. They're close. Hmm. Defend your future. There's so many places that you can go here. Like I, there was another door that I could have gone in the other way. But I didn't go because I thought this was going to be a shorter route. I guess there's multiple routes, routes that you can take. So equipment requisition form rejected. One respirator, one filter. If rejected, reason for rejection. Private Young already has a gas mask signed out. Private Young. Oh, ain't this some shit? Mustard gas. Interesting. Maybe they're through here. Yeah, maybe, Brad. But, you know, we gotta check this out first, right? Okay. Oh, God, Brad. Oh, God. Brad, what are we doing here, Brad? Brad, what are we doing here? Brad, let's get out of here. your ass if this gets out see that it's done internal okay to all field officers ensure the locks are affixed to caskets as soon as they have been located at, at the water purification project facility the caskets are classified they must remain locked and un and under guard at all times no personnel in your unit should have access and we already fucking opened them How convenient. That is very convenient. Huh. Oh, God. Interesting. Oh dear. This is exact. I think this isn't this where uh, where Fliss was with Danny. Alex, Julia, hello. No, this is not it. Oh God. Oh look, another picture. A chopper. Well, that could lead us to. He escaped from here, right? A chopper. Is there anything else that I can interact with here on this table? Absolutely not. Absolutely fantastic. All right. Well, let's get going. I'm telling you, man, these graphics are awesome. I love these camera angles. I mean, I don't love them because they scared the Jesus out of me, but they're really effective. I'm trying to get the job done. To scare the living shit out of the place. Oh god, okay, yeah, sure. Why not slam the fucking door? Brad is still alive. Everyone's still alive except probably Conrad. But he may actually still be alive as well. I'm not gonna go. Who's that? Who's there? Get away! I'm not gonna go into any doors or anything until I secure the entire perimeter up here. Okay. That's a door right there, so I'm not going to touch that just yet. Ah, no, 
No, I'm not hearing this. I'm not hearing this. <laughs> oh, look, there's more things over here. All right. Skeletons. Skeletons. They're skeletons? They're just skeletons. They're just skeletons. Where is this? Some sort of altercation. We were able to pick up indirect message traffic until 140 hours. However, there has been no further incoming message track at all since that time. If possible, is it possible that a radio equipment is faulty? I'm investigating. Um, I'm investigation and expect to be able to report back to you by oh, 300 hours. <sighs> Wrench. Do we take it? Do we not? Oh God, this may not be good. Hey there, buddy. You're not supposed to be out here. I'm not supposed to see this. You're not. What if this is all like a big fucking prank? Do you imagine? I will literally be so pissed. <laughs> Drop down. Uh. Hold on, before I drop down, let me check that other door. Huh. Maybe we need the, the wrench to break it? No? Oh, come on, dude. You gonna tell me we can't open that shit or climb up top? Come on. I'm gonna do one quick little circular motion around here. Just in case we might miss something else. You never know. What is this here? That's exactly, that's where we came from. Are we really gonna drop into the water, bro? Oh, goodness. That's the same dude we saw right now. I'm trying to do this as smartly as possible. I'm trying to like, let all this information sink in. And, uh, Alex? Make sure we make the right Julia? proper adjustments. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> you fucking crazy? They're all they're all separated. This is so stupid. Huh? What is going on here? Yeah, that was actually Brad. Please. Another bullet. Hmm. I don't think we could keep going that way. Oh God. No 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 fuck 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 Bullshit. What in 
god's name is this? The lower deck. And it is completely impeccable. This is, this is unbelievable. This has got to be in a hallucination or something. This is a hallucination without a doubt. I don't care what anybody says right now. We are hallucinating. I am telling you. The lighthouse? <gasps> is that the lighthouse this man was talking about in that creepy story in the beginning of the first episode? This place is not or right. second episode, I think it was. Kabash is silently assemble, and no, more fear than five true individuals of sound mind and spirit. Should number three female and two male, firstborn, faces obscured with hood, sigils. Nor it is important to the sorcerer and the spiritual well-being. Block that before the festival of Arkamahamari can. Ritual of the uh, Theriskia is performed to went away demons. By means of cabal, the pentangle shall be drawn out, and each member shall stand at each of the five primary points. Okay. A lady born of the seas shall be rendered unconscious and placed at the center of the pen pentacle. It is from there that the assembled should recite the incantation of Sora's sword in hand, with all ex exaltation. Possible, as in writ as is written. We five stand at the four th uh, furthermost point. We are yet close enough to touch pentagram, the five-starred great power, turning ninety degrees to your to described the unescursed universal. Fuck! Out the per uh, pentangle is faith. Sword forward and using rents turn degrees to describe the ocuvernal sigil. What the fuck am I reading? Constitutes the uh, with reverence turned to face north with exultation exclaim. Yeah, whatever fuck this Some type of ritual voodoo bull crap I don't think I think it's been a really long time since I played a game and I have like palpitations and like trouble breathing when reading shit like that on here wow okay that is not good yeah that's blood dripping from no known source of fountain see this is like very nicely cleaned and well taken care of part of the ship but it looks like it's just a cursed area which makes you think it looks like this but in reality it's probably not even this nice it probably never was I know there was something here that I can interact with Why can't I go there? What the hell? I'm pretty sure there was something on that table. On this thing, it was glowing. What the hell, man? All right, whatever. I'm pretty sure there was something there. I'm getting stuck in between those, like, these invisible walls. It's annoying the crap out of me. Going to play the piano. Ah! 
Fuck a piano. Of course. I would play the fucking piano. God damn it. Alright. Come on, Bliss. Keep your head on straight. So, no, sorry, I'm not going for that. Mm -mm. You see the way my uh, brain works. It's I'm not retarded. Let's look at this picture here. Stop. Someone was being drowned. Oh dear. Oh God, maybe we don't have to go there or maybe we do. Of course we do. Why the freak wouldn't we have to go there? Oh my goodness. Are we really going to go to the freaking abandoned casket coffin? This is too weird. This is way too weird. This is the main one. Probably the one with all the juices and why is this fucking blood? What the hell? Stop freezing, damn it. Oh, no. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. There was a picture here. Yep, I, I remember it perfectly. Not that one. There was a picture here somewhere. Somewhere. One of not one of these. I think it was this one. This looks this good in this gen. Imagine next gen games when they do them for this. It's gonna look great. It's gonna be really freaking great. Yo, behind you, behind you. Really? Why would you do that? This is another premonition. Where he's gonna try and, uh. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the hell? Oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no. This is just a hallucination. Oh God, that sucks. How much underwater breath does this lady have? Oh, what the fuck? Come on. 
That's what the that's what the the picture told us to do. Stop. Get away. He's still around. That, that guy. Oh, dear fuck. God. Oh, come on. Oh, what? Yo, what the fuck is this? Come on. Let's go. Dude, what a What is going on here? Wait, what? How is he dead? He's not dead. We didn't kill him. We did everything we were supposed to do. This has got to be that other guy, Olsen. Keep your hands on this shit at all times. What does this mean? Does this mean we're over? Jump, run. Jump, jump, jump. Shit. Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Keep going. Fight back. Keep going. Good shit, Alex. I'll lock that shit. Oh my god, oh my god. Maybe he's gone? Oh! Oh! Fliss! Oh, thank god. Yeah, it's me. Come on, let's go. Alright, well, we're outside now. That's good. We're in the outer part of the ship. Why are the lights on in the ship still? That's what I don't understand. It's kind of crazy. We just need to find Brad, man. Are we good here? They won't spot us here. Oh my god, dude. Oh, hello. This has been so crazy. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual. Oh, yeah? What you say? I don't know, man. I don't know what the fuck's going on here, okay? <laughs> now you're another one, Dad. I don't know how he died, though. And has anyone seen Brad? Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways. Uh. You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. 
I don't feel like I did anything wrong to kill Brad, though. Let me help you out. Give you a little hint. Confident. Uh... Sure, just give me a hint. I don't care. Well, then, how can I put this? There may be forces at play here that are more scientific and even some that are more political, you know? Less supernatural. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. It does not. <laughs> well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go on, back to it. it Speak soon. It's weird because like we were supposed to jump, right? That's that's what that's where the game was leading us. So I checked that entire floor with Brad and then it's kind of weird. Like, why would you go back the same door you came in through? So the only thing left was to just jump down. So Did you happen to see Brad down there? My uh, brotherly instincts are going pretty crazy right now. Uh, I got to tell him the truth. There was some kind of fucked up ceremony going on down there. Someone saw me. There's one prick in a room. He attacked me. Wait, what? Who attacked you? Some asshole in a robe. Ah, I don't know. Well, if there's one thing Brad is good at, it's voiding confrontations. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like evil, like literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. Relax, bro. You know that, right? Just go. No, I know. It's just. This can't all be happening. Maybe, like, one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's gotta be something going on here. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Where's the gold? Is this a ghost ship? <laughs> Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? I was gonna say the same thing. Well, I know we're not the first people to see weird shit here. Apparently the guards were super freaked out by something they saw in the cargo holds. We found a note that said a bunch of guys tried to get out of guard duty because they were really freaked out by something. Are the crew what happened to this ship? What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big floating coffin. So where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. Exactly. Everybody was like, and that's how they died. Just not going to say anything. Oh, I do have to say something. Okay. What do you think actually happened to this place? No idea. I saw 1947 on the newspaper. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. So you just call somebody over the radio. The ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it, that's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. If you have been enjoying the series, um, let me know in the comments. Or... Get off this damn ship. 
I don't know. Yeah. So right now, we have to go on top of the ship to a uh, radio call for help. That is what we're tasked to do at the moment. We have more bullets here. Really, really old bullets. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. And this game has been really, really creepy. And I was talking about it. This is one of those games where you feel like, you know, the jump scare is coming, but you still get scared. H how is that even a thing? <laughs> how can we be so stupid? I don't know. It just happens. And they do a really well job at executing that. Because there has been some really obvious jump scares here, but shit, have they scared me. More bullet holes. Great. Could use these if they weren't Swiss cheesed. That's actually very true. <laughs> Could have just jumped on that shit. Sailed away. See, it's kind of weird for me to convince myself that it's going to get worse. I mean, I know it is, but I feel like what's worse than underground? Because we were pretty much underneath the ship. Now we got to go above it. I don't know, man. I'm just overall very skeptical about this. Is what is skeptic? Is that the? I don't even know. Just, yeah, it is skeptical. Find a way up. Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Okay, so this is where we have to figure shit out. Okay, leave it to Alex. We got this. I'm the man of this group. So far, we have two possible casualties. I'm not sure if they're exactly. Oh, God, oh, wow. Okay. Oh look, it's a note. The question here is, why the hell was, was this man hiding there? Let me pick that up. See what the note says. It's a weird spot to die in. Gas mask instructions. Always ensure your mask is fitted before assisting anyone else with theirs. If you detect gas or hear gas, these are the alarms and drills you have to follow. One, do not panic. Remain calm and clear to shout gas, gas, gas. To warn anyone in the vicinity. Hold your breath. Number two, attach the mask. I'll carry by placing the bag under your left arm, pull the shoulder sling over your right shoulder, and hook it onto the bag. Hook the belt around your waist. Three, remove your helmet, pull the mask up to your face with both hands, put your chin inside the mask first, then pull the mask over your face and let the harness straps um, and, and the harness straps over your over your head. Four, remove potentially trapped gas. Close the outlet valve and breathe out sharply, then push any remaining air out of the mask with your hand. Five. Check for leaks by tightly squeezing the flexible uh, corrugated hose with your hands and inhaling. The mask should crumple around your face. Number six, if the mask does not crumple, there may be a leak. Readjust the mask to ensure it's snug and repeat the process above until the mask crumples to ensure there is no leaks. Okay. Thank you. So, yeah, what really cursed this place was obviously those coffins had some crazy fucking voodoo shit on it but it was like this mysterious gas that just spread all over the entire ship and I guess it's safe to say it's witchcraft right so I don't know hey a little help over here we got a way up boys I have a feeling things are starting to get real crazy now I know I it I think this is our way up give me a lift Pull you up. Hmm. All right, here we go. I don't think we should go here. All right, upstairs we go. The thing I don't understand is why can they just go to their ship? They're around. This is what makes no sense to me. We are outside of the ship right now. We can go around the perimeter of the outside of the ship and just literally go to our yacht and just radio people there. I don't understand why we can't just do that. It's kind of like same thing in the movies. There's some simple solutions, but the protagonists just don't do them. And it's just to make the audience more terrified.
Oh fuck, this is not good. This is some bullshit. Over here. Got a way through here. Mm -mm. Don't do it. Don't do it, bro. Don't do it. Mm -mm. Do not go in there. <sighs> no, don't close it. God, I wanted to go the other way. Shit, I wanted to go the other way to see what was up there. This is where we were being watched from. There's definitely somebody here. For sure there's somebody in here. Another picture. Thank you. So Junior is going to shoot himself in the head. Find a radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? <gasps> Land route. Actual route. That's kind of weird, huh? Secret found. A map showing the origin and destination of the ship. It was sailing from the Republic of China to San Francisco. United States Department of the Navy. Uh, ship was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Alright. I kind of want to go the other way. Okay, before I come here, I know there was a stair that led down below. The thing is, I don't know if we should take that route. See, over here, there was a stair over here. I just don't know if this is the right thing to do. Hey there, buddy. Okay. Oh, look at this. Did we search this already? A log book. We have not searched this. Or have we? I'm going crazy. No, we have not. Operational logs for SS Orang. Orang. See that SS. Hmm. Huh. Last log shows them caught in a storm. All right, so the weather continues to deteriorate as does forecast. Crew bearing up. AM wind at a storm force, gaining strength. Weather is exceptional with several lightning strikes hitting OM, but causing no sustained damage. We're leaking some water, but it's under control. Navigator ports, seabed depth readable. Okay. Did we interact with this door already? I'm sorry, man. There's certain things here that I forget if I interact with them. So many freaking angles that. See, this is the one I was talking about over here. Does this cause? 
Oh, it doesn't let me go there. <gasps> okay, thank God. Okay, okay, fine. We'll go back. So I thought there was like a stair there. Which would uh, put us down at a lower deck or something. And I really kind of don't like when it does that. Because that you have to kind of decide where, whether you go this way or that way. And then you might miss something on the other side instead of the other one. I don't know. I like when it's kind of straightforward. Just so we experience everything little by little. One thing at a time, per se. Anyways, we'll go here and we'll get uh, radio calling then. Our job here is done. We have reached our destination. Yeah, that's gross. Looks like this poor sucker bit it right in the middle of his message. Mm, <clears throat> sounds pretty desperate. Radio operations 02, uh, 0201. Mayday call broadcast. Radio contacts intermittent. Attempted more SOS. Many crew dead. I died. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Look, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's have some for help. Hey! Hey! Is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Over. What was that? The group discovered a radio and made contact with a military station. Holy shit! We got him! Uh... If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees, 30 minutes south, 151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. Please repeat. Please repeat. Over. We're on this like old freighter. We think the name of it is the Iran Medan. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please, come in! Oh. Look at this! Oh my god, dude. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go, obviously. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this, trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. All right, you and me, Julia. An idiot. You can't handle shit. Ah, Jesus Christ. I don't want any more people dead, bro. Seriously. Are you alive? Please. Okay, thank God. Oh, she's cut. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, Julia, baby. I'm sorry. Just getting nervous. Any broken bones? Everything still work? <laughs> Is everyone all right? <laughs> Everything's still I'm okay. Do you see anything? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. I'll wait here by the radio. Sure you will. And get fucking killed. Here. What is there? Some mysterious lighter just hanging around the ship? Hey. Okay. After you. Oh, 
Come here, baby. Get that little ass out of my screen right now. You are distracting my concentration skills. The sick bay. Looks like we're in the lower levels of the ship. So we were just happy because we were on the top. Now we're all the way at the bottom of the food chain. Like the lowest, lowest part of the ship. Could it get any freaking worse? So it looks like there was some sort of fight and this Charlie went to the brig. So in that private Charles Anderson on leave from duty did display intoxication in the manner not becoming of a member of the U.S. Army. Private Anderson was engaging with another soldier in a drunken argument. It is the opinion of the arresting officer that this would lead to a public brawl and steps were taken to ensure that both men were returned to their ship. 10 day sentence. <laughs> Must have been a big fight. Jesus Christ. The Brig Week Monday, Arthur Miller. Wait, didn't we? We already read this. We were here already in the, in the first episode. Or in the second, we were here. But it's different with every character, right? But I know we read that argument. I mean, that report. Yep. You read that already. Interesting. I am pretty sure. See, this was... Medical officer's report. Minutes of meeting between scientists X, CWO Walter Bishop, and CWO Tom Palmer with Sergeant Peter Wood... Observing and and then there's missing letters extra meeting with our team and say we can ma uh, mutually learn for the same thing the Western world must be protected from the United States has been aware of the certain agencies investigating the chemical and biological agents in warfare our act X whatever the hell their act is limited by the general protocol have experiments we are unable to describe an investigation during to test the effects on human subjects of the molecules crystal structure hallucinogens codenamed manchurian gold chemical mutation munitions battle it was even relatively minor observed to trigger significant hallucinations men so that's what it is that powder shit i think that's what it is highly convincing subjects seeing and hearing things that really were not there even the danger was manifold and its intensity. Oh, God. So that's why these people are hallucinating. Hallucinating or not, still scary as fuck, all right? First. I'm gonna need a hundred hot baths if we ever get out of here. First aid. We're gonna get out of here, Julia. I hope you're right. Am I ever wrong? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. Fuck. Ooh, okay, we weren't here. There's a lot of reading in this part here. Okay, so this is where we start learning about things. So the patient named John Patterson, private Texas, 1922. Listed or operator. Uh, history of case, diagnosis, mild neurosis. Disability is not the result of his own misconduct and was in incurred in the line of dude of dude. Existed prior to the enlistment. No. Presented condition, fit of service, profitable future duration, temporary recommendation to uh, that he be closely monitored and referred back to medical checking in one week. Facts are as follow. I saw Private Patterson today who attended sick bay during that visit. I observed signs of severe uh, se severe distress consistent with evidence of panic. I observed in the same soldier during this uh, during his watch duty earlier this week. They're all hallucinating. I, I think that's what's going on here. I requested Patterson's uh, see me today as I believed his panic to be accompanied by vivid and disturbing memories. In the past, he has managed to continue his duties as, sympt uh, as symptoms appear to alleviate after his guard shift. He claims these symptoms are very unusual for him. That's why nobody wanted to really be on guard duty, you know? Private Patterson is fit and healthy, a young man of 25 years of age with no known medical conditions and an ex uh, exemplary military career. 
He was able to uh, he was able to calm down during the course of our meeting and test for speech, reactions, memory, and decision making. All appeared to be normal. Clear case of COSR. And here we go. Wow. Jesus. Still's got hair. He still got that hair. And all these people fucking died in a horrible way here. This is kid, man. Might have been the son of someone on board. Your pops. Come back soon. That's that's hard, man. That is fucking hard. This is the same exact room we were in in the beginning. When we were playing with the beginning characters. Yep. Oh dear. Okay. Is there anything here that you saw that I'm not looking at? Julie? No? Julie, is that a hallway, Julie? Julie? No? Okay. Julie, why are you standing like that? You creepy me the fuck out. Hold on. Give me a sec. Come take a look. Look. Down there. I think that's the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Let's find out. Shit. No more ladder. I can drop the rest of the way. Wait. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Come on down. Every time uh, they do something, I, I feel like. Oh, fuck! What's up? Uh, you didn't fucking see that? Fuck my ass! No. Of course you didn't. Um. Hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seeing clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. So, the ship was carrying Manchurian gold. But that turned out not to be gold at all, it's a toxic chemical. And there's this weird fog everywhere, right? Well, maybe that's Manchurian gold, and maybe we're breathing it in and it's fucking us right the hell up. I sure as shit saw some stuff I cannot believe. And maybe I was right not to believe it. I was hallucinating. I guess it makes sense, though. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. Yeah. They're all seeing this crazy shit going down and they all thought it was real. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. It was a search and rescue plane. The whole reason it even came out here was because the people on the ship sent out a distress signal. I guess by the time the plane got here, it was too late. Everyone on the ship had lost their minds, so they shot it down. Who knows what the hell they were thinking, or what they thought they saw. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. Look at all the freaking Maturian gold, or whatever the hell that's called. It's all around here. You know what that means? Where about, where, where about, where, where about I get scared shitless? A lot of it here. And Linden engine works. These are engine number 1734, year 1920 type L87 CSE. You ever wonder what would have happened if we went to Japan on vacation instead? Shut up. Trying to go around in a circle to see what's up. Okay, definitely. Okay, hold on. Hold on, give me a second. Give me a fucking second. This is this is disturbing. Hold on. I'm gonna go the other way. Because there's something there. I didn't want to go over there because again I thought this was gonna be a short end and then I'd have to come back over here, but it looks like it's the other way around. It looks like this is a short end here. I think. Yeah, it 
it is. Here we go. Engine room. Engine room telegraph log. I had Bella known. Uh, Bella acknowledged engine speed adjusted. Santa had Bella acknowledged engine set to standard speed. Lieutenant Young reported to relieve me of watch duty. I replayed engine running at standard speed with no special or stranding orders from bridge. Found the Lieutenant Young to be was sober and composed meant to disposition to hand over watch at 2400. Inspected engine room. Previous log entries examined. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Chief Engineer entered. Okay. So that's just the log of the engine room. What they did. Every time somebody did something, it was logged in that book. Blah, blah, blah. And now we go back. I know that doesn't seem very important, but you have to search everything. If you want to survive. Do you want to survive? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm just scared. And when I get scared, man, I tend to talk a lot of shit. So I'm just talking. Okay. I think we're in the clear. Nothing has been searchable except for this. I found it. Oh, thank God. <sighs> and it's working. Oh God. Yeah, this is it, all right. Just throw the switch and let's get back upstairs. Thing is, why did somebody? Okay, let's get back up there. We'll have to find a new way up. Oh God. Oh. We lost power. It could happen again. We're back up now. Do you read us? Over. Please state your situation. Over. God damn it! We're Listen, fucking lost. My boat. They kidnapped us and they are attacking us on the freighter. You have to hurry, please. Over. Recovery mission is on route to your location. Over. Location is confirmed. Damn it. Old piece of junk. Oh, we got it. We got this. I don't like the fact that there's so much, uh, So much of this gold here. Hey, look at this. The rebreather. What is it doing here? I bet the fisherman brought it from the Duke. You think it still works? Uh, it's got maybe a few minutes of air left. Worth taking with us? It's just gonna slow us down. God, take it. No, we should take it. Parts of the ship are completely underwater. No, I don't know what you're doing. Tell me what you're doing. Tell me Ferme ta gueule de merde Tu dis n'importe quoi Tout ce que tu racontes, c'est des conneries Alors, ferme ta sale gueule de merde Écoute. Écoute-moi. Non. Fais pas ça Ta gueule ah Je t'avais dit de fermer ta gueule Oh, fuck mmh. It's gone crazy, dude. There's th oh yes, 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 yes. It's right there. We have to be careful, though. Oh, he's, he's going fucking crazy. He's breathing that shit in so bad. Oh God. Man, 
menacent les mouilles qui viennent chercher. Les esprits des morts viennent me chercher. Fuck. Oh, that's horrible. God, that's fucking horrible. Now you can wear that. So you can get whatever it is you need to get, right? No? Okay, didn't we take it? Oh, he did. I think we should try to avoid that. Yep. Yeah. We gotta get out of here now. <gasps> Shit. Oh. He's coming. Inspect. Uh, run. Run. Fuck out of here. Need to go. Let's go. Let's go. It's gonna slow us down, huh? That shit is gonna slow us down. Oh no, why why is she carrying it? Oh my god, he's gone bananas. There's no use hiding, you little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deal? Not this again. This is horrible. You can't have all the gold. Then I'm to be left here to die. But I am the captain. I am in control. And I am the one that says who goes and who stays. Ah. Oh my god, I hate that. He's breathing down our necks. Please tell me you have an escape plan. Yeah, because we have that scuba thing. The smug Americans have smashed their way into a foreign land and come up short. This is so nerve wracking. The are on. One, two. The gold is one, mine. Two. And now one, two. I'm the one who one, gets to smash. Me! With my big fucking armor! Shit is fucking horrible. I hate that topic crap. Oh, holy fuck, lock it! The fuck is Alex doing? Wow, really? Is hold? Or do we need to start running again? We're good. You lost a friend. Right breather, man. Can't believe it. Dude, that thing gets really intense. on me now. Turn around. Slow. Very slow. He's gonna shoot himself. Okay. Tell the premonition. All right. Not changing. None of that. Raise your hands up. Slow. No, no. Not like that. I said no changing. Just put the gun down. Nobody has to get hurt. You think I wanted to hurt anybody? I didn't get a choice in this, did I? It's in you too, isn't it? Isn't it now? Ha! Ah, not again! It's all gone changing on me! What? What's changing? Stay away! Stay back from the mist! Hey! There's no mist, man! Don't breathe it! Don't breathe the mist! I'm not gonna say anything. It's inside now. Inside with us now. Please just calm down. Stop! Stop! It's 
kill one of us, isn't it? Put the gun down, now! Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you breathed in the mist! It's happening. I can feel it! Okay. Look, there was something in the last room. A, a, a fog or a mist, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No! No, I, I mean, we held our breath, man. The, the mist is not inside of us. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. You're holding your breath right now. Oh, God. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? It's in me, isn't it? Uh, uh, I can't feel it swirling around in there. It's changing me. On the inside. Grab. Distract. No, man. There's, there's no mist inside you. I can tell. Stop. Stop lying. You can all see it in me, can't you? You're all just lying. The mist is inside. much man great that's just fucking great wants to go in the water we lost a freaking thing yeah sure let's just start drowning ourselves in puddles now why not We lost a freaking rebreather, man. I'm so pissed. That tapping a, so a far, thing. The possibilities are death by gunfire, death by falling, death by drowning, and now death by boredom. Uh, or death by the golden mist. Hey, what's happening? Okay, damn it. It's time to go down in the hole. No. Oh shit, shit, shit. Is there anything here? Hello? I don't like these camera, man. These camera angles are freaking horrifying. I mean, I like them because they do scare you, but I don't like them because I don't want to be getting scared, man. What the fuck? Okay, this weekend I go down there. So I guess our only way is to go up straight. I just wanted to come back here just in case. Found another painting, I mean, another picture, or I don't know. God knows, bro. Some other shit. Nothing here. Gotta investigate as many things that we as we possibly can. Okay. Here we go. Sorry, sorry, I'm nervous. I'm just pressing all these buttons for no reason. I don't like being alone. I'd rather be with somebody else, man. Please. 
Riley's fucking Brad or I don't know something. You're crazy for doing this barefoot. You are one crazy ass chick. Oh God. Oh God. Fuck, fuck, fuck. That's Brad. That's Brad. I saw Brad's ghost. So many parts in this ship look so similar to the other ones. It's kind of distracting. Y'all think I've been here already and I probably haven't. Huh. I don't know. The gentle sounds of a haunted nightmare boat. Exactly. A haunted boat. A ship. It's cursed. Full of full of gold mist. You don't want to be here right now. Oh, another another picture. I'm gonna need that. What the hell? Somebody slipped? Oh, fuck. A little hope. Oh, why is this the middle one? Alright. Hello? To all field orders, the skill of our search and, and recovery missions across the area have yielded results far greater than expected. Unfortunately, there is now a shortage of adult uh, caskets. If you locate the remains of any missing persons at the, waiter pur at the water purification plant, you may have to use the smaller caskets. I guess it'll have to be Hawkins. Poor bastard. There's almost nothing left of him. I know this is the ideal guy. This isn't the ideal guy. This isn't the uh, this this isn't ideal, guys. But we'll give him a proper funeral and the respect he deserves once we've got his body back home. We just have to make this work for now. Okay. Poor bastard. Ship bag. You're a literal piece of shit on a bag. This is deja vu. So here it's it's not fancy here. This is where it's not fancy. This is the actual thing. So what she saw last time where it was all fancy was just a hallucination, I think. Cask is gonna go up. 
Maybe that wakes us up. so nervous right now. your hands at all times here dude and the controller dead. Thank God. <laughs> Punk ass. That's right. Don't fuck with us, man. Jesus. This is funky as fuck. Man, this has been insane. Like, sometimes Whoa. you can't even pay attention to the cutscene because you have to focus on, like, the buttons and stuff. Oh, no. No. how we got him killed honestly i don't know if that's part of the story so i remember doing everything right well we survived holy cow <laughs> Did we win? Why is he hugging the other, not his fiance? That makes no sense. All right, let's try it. What happened? Did we end up really killing 
two people? Really? Oh, it's not over yet. Of course not. I swear I'm telling you everything I know. I didn't see Brad. There was this crazy guy in a hood. That's it. I just want to know what happened to my brother. He was trying to help us to, to, to get help, but he doesn't know anything about boats or sailing. I just hope he's alive, that he's okay. God, we should have never split up. Yeah, we should have stayed together for that one. But I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. I'm sure a lot of people that have played this game killed him too because of that. Because you would, you would think, damn, you know? Okay, what, what? He's alive? Wait. Conrad bled out on the speedboat at sea. No. No. Oh, God. Oh, my God. That is creepy. I thought it wasn't that bad. Like, we'd have everybody survive, but we, we, we saved most of the crew for it being a first-time playthrough with no guidance whatsoever. I think we did pretty good. I don't know why the second Brad died. I don't know why he died. I know why That's it. Game Conrad, over. maybe, but... You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again. See if you can't do better next time around. Not a bad effort. Some lived, some died. All your fault. Uh, ass wipe. I suppose when the curtain falls, you're either ready for it or you're not. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, oh, made with sure. the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. Oh, God. There are always repercussions. Now oh, what? Is that it? Is this the end? By the way, this is the, this game is going to release. I think they're intending to release two games every six. Till we meet uh, again. Every year. Maybe in Little Hope. Maybe somewhere else. So Little Hope is going to be but the next. Certain. We will meet again. Little Hope is the next it's game inevitable okay thanos yeah so little hope is gonna be the next game it comes out uh 2020 so it's gonna be very just like this so they're gonna be releasing two games a year huh he survived oh shit wait there's more Not, no, we're already gone, man. What are you? What are you guys doing here? We're gone. Oh my lord! So out of nowhere, this thing just sent out an SOS. Guess we got a real life ghost ship here. gonna die <laughs> whoa what the hell is this well it's gonna be the last time you ever see daylight you're about to damn die Well, guys, that's going to conclude our adventure in Man of Medan. Tomorrow, we get a brand new horror game called Blair Witch, and we should also venture off into that game as well and see what that game has in stores for us. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And as always, if you did, 
Be sure to leave it a like. Helps me out a lot. And I'll catch you on the next one.